Hey everybody, this is Todd. I'm Lana. Um, today we're going to talk about the seven things you should not say when selling your house. Now before we get started, please subscribe to the channel and hit the notification bell to get notifications when we post new videos. Also, our contact information is below. If you're thinking of buying or selling anywhere, please reach out to us. Now, the first thing that you should never say when selling your house is... The house is in great condition, it's in perfect condition, it's never had any problems, there's no need for a home inspection. None of those things should be coming out of your mouth, please. Yeah, so you don't want to say, the house is perfect. That's what you don't want to say. Right. So don't talk about the condition of the home. They can figure out the condition of the home themselves. They're going to have a home inspection, so they will figure out the condition of the home. The second one is... Price. Don't talk about how you're not going to take a penny less than what's offered or that it's a great value. Don't try to convince them on the price. Just set the price properly so that you get the most number of people looking at the house. The third thing you should not say when you're selling your house is... The house has been on the market for six months. Don't talk about how long the house has been on the market. Just like most things that have been on the shelf for a long time, if nobody else wanted it, they probably don't want it either. Let them make up their own mind about your home and let them make an offer on your home. The fourth thing is... Not to omit anything uh, that you put in the seller's disclosures. So don't say, hey, there's nothing wrong with the dishwasher. If in the seller's disclosure, you put that the dishwasher was broken and it need, needs repairs. Okay, you don't want to say anything specific about the property that you didn't already disclose. And if there is something wrong with the property, please disclose it. Do not omit anything. Write in there everything that you know is wrong with the property. Everybody appreciates honesty. Number five. Uh, don't talk about renovations that you haven't made that you're planning on making. And then if you did renovations, don't talk about how expensive they were. Uh, that's going to scare off a buyer. It's going to make them think you overbuilt the house for the, for the condition of the house and for the type of home. And you're likely just to make them think the home is over improved. So just don't talk about the renovations. It'll be clear to them when they see the house. They'll walk in, they'll see that stuff's been updated or that it's been renovated. That'll be clear, but don't, don't talk about the renovations. Uh, the sixth thing you should not say when selling your house is... Don't commit to replacing or fixing something that you have not already agreed to in writing. So um, a lot of times people will say, well, you know, I'll just go ahead and replace that for you. Uh, please don't do that uh, because then if you don't do it, that causes problems at closing. Do everything that you agreed to do in writing and offer nothing else. Uh, the seventh and final thing you should not say when you're selling your house is... Home is being sold as is. Uh, that makes buyers very uncomfortable because they think that maybe there are things wrong with the property. The other thing, it's, it's sort of disingenuous because if the buyer is getting financing and there are financing conditions regarding the property, uh, then you're going to have to make those repairs in order for the buyer to secure financing. So it's really a bad way for you to put yourself forward out there and your house forward out there. We want to make sure that your home is appealing to all buyers. When, whenever you say as is, you're sending this message to the buyer that there's something wrong with the house, that you're not going to fix anything, and they're just stuck with it how it is. There's no reason to say that. All of this is part of real estate language. It's part of things that we disclose and part of things that we repair. There's going to be inspections on the house. There's going to be all of this. Just don't say it sold as is. It's like the worst thing you could do is saying the home is sold as is. This is real estate, everything is negotiable. Just remember that. If you liked the video, please subscribe. Please hit the notification bell. And if you think this video would be helpful to somebody, please share it. Uh, we'd love to see your comments down below and we'll respond.